I think most people will agree with me. Windows search sucks. So I'm always looking for some good alternative. And I think I have found my favorite Windows search alternative. And I'm saying this after using it for more than a month now. And I'm just loving this thing. Now, there are a couple of apps that can actually replace Windows search. Like for example, Flow Launcher. This is free and open source. Looks good. I've also tested this. I also tried Fluent Search. This is also free and open source, looks good, also works okay. And I think I used Power Toys Run for a very long time. I stayed with this because it was minimal. It didn't have too many options to confuse you and all that. It was okay, let's just say that. And I actually used it for a very long time. Now I'm using this. Power Toys Command Palette Utility. This is the second video I'm making about this and I'm just loving this thing. And guess what? This is made by Microsoft. This is a new plugin for Power Toys, just like Power Toys Run. And this is how it looks. Let me show you guys, okay? This feels like I'm using some sort of Windows 11 feature. The look and feel is like really good, okay? Now, this comes with many features and it also uses plugins and everything plugin is now also available in here. So if I do file, enter, now I can search for my files and it just instantly finds the files. It's super fast. And let me actually show you guys. I actually have disabled Windows search indexing. Windows indexing sucks. Search sucks everything just sucks here i just don't like it so if i try to search anything i mean it will find some files somehow oh somehow it is turned on okay my bad um maybe i forgot to turn this thing off the indexing is now completely turned off somehow it was turned on my bad so if i go into the indexing here you can see indexing status not running so i have this thing turned off because i don't need it now if i use windows search yeah everything is just completely turned off yeah it can still find some system apps but it's not indexing anything now now this thing the command palette thingy is just wonderful Okay, it also works with the Windows indexing, but I prefer the everything. So I have the everything plugin installed and I also have the everything running here in the background. It just works really fast. You can run command, calculate, you can also add bookmarks. Uh, you can also search for webs and this option. This is also one of the best feature of this thing. So if you select this option, search Winget, here you can actually search for the programs and install them. Okay, let's say uh, 7-zip and here are the results and you can just install the programs here basically. Again, as I said, I have been using this for a almost a month now and this thing is working really well. I don't have any major issues. It just works. Okay, let's go into the settings extensions here you can enable and disable the extensions let's just say you don't want to do the calculation just turn that off okay it won't appear here basically there are extensions available so there is this option called install command palette extensions click on it here the everything cmd pal this is the extension that i'm using to search for files uh, using the everything so basically it's super fast compared to the windows search and there are many other extensions that you can download like uh, for example web search uh, shortcut github extension some fun ones random j dad jokes extension <laughs> this thing just works really well okay i have zero complaints against this thing this is the best thing that microsoft has made for windows really good okay there is the bookmark thingy this one is also really interesting uh, let me give you guys uh, a demo i'm gonna go into the downloads folder i'm gonna copy the path of this uh, downloads folder and i'm gonna go to the bookmark option i'm gonna give it a name downloads let's say here you can put the path of the folder or url of the website whatever you want to do so i'm going to put it here and i'm going to save it now this download folder will appear whenever you launch the command palette here in the list okay and 
let me actually show you guys here if i go into the extension and then go to the bookmarks here i can actually give this a alias name and i can also assign a keyboard shortcut to this so whenever you press that keyboard shortcut it will launch that website or folder let me actually uh, give you guys a demo now windows control d so whenever i press this it will open that folder i can also give it a name dl D. Now, if I go and open the command palette, I can search DLD and the downloads folder will appear at the top because it's the alias name, short name for the um, downloads folder. Okay, or I can press Windows plus Control plus D key to open that download folder without opening the command palette. So I can do Windows, Control and D. Oh no, this is a shortcut for something else in the windows. I need to change the shortcut. So let's go and change the shortcut. Let's do shift, okay? Windows, sh control shift D. Let's do that. Now, without opening command palette, we're gonna do windows, control shift D and the downloads folder will open. You can do many things with it. You can organize your files and folders with shortcuts or alias name. It is just a wonderful thing. It is just 100 times better than anything that I have ever used. I know nothing is perfect, neither this. You may find some bugs here and there. Like for example, let me actually give you guys one uh, example. <laughs> okay, if I want to uninstall a extension, let's say for example this one, uh, there is an update available. I already updated this, so the update won't go away, the update thingy. So if the update thingy don't go away, I can't uninstall this extension basically. It asks me to update, but I already updated it. So there are a couple of things here and there. And as you guys know, Power Toys is still in beta. So you'll find some quirks here and there. For day-to-day -day use, yeah, this thing, it's actually usable. Again, as I said, I have been using it for more than a month now, and this thing just works really well. Okay, it's just a perfect Windows search alternative. If you're also sick and tired of Windows search, yeah, you need to try this out, okay? And uh, the funny thing is that this is made by the Microsoft. So basically, Microsoft did something good this time, at least with this application. Yeah, that's it for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. But if you still have any questions or have any suggestions for me, you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too. Yeah, that's it. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.